a day makes oh my goodness me so bless you thank you for all those who sent me messages and rang it was amazing I really had a big wobble yesterday as I think you all saw um, I was okay and I put the microphone on somebody said something and that was it I was committed I couldn't stop I had to really allow the angels just to come through and it is their moment it is this moment for the angels so I uh, I'm going to use those angelic words I'm sorry because it was absolute Daisy Foss in the moment and uh, all angels say sorry when they are are not sure what else to say so I am back to a degree uh, very fragile um, as I'm sure all of you are. I was amazed at how many people are also feeling this way. Thank you for being so honest with me because uh, this is for you, this moment, these moments. He's 11 minutes every day. The angels are quite insistent and I've got my big ball of calcite with me again because this is holding on to the pearl of the heart, holding on to this space when of course what they really want us to do is to let go. Let go of all of the burdens, of the pains, of all the things that we've really been, you know, struggling with. And my goodness me, have we been struggling. I've got a pocket full of stones. I've still got the uh, garnets with me. And it really is taking, taking care of yourself and, you know, having the courage to stop. I just literally went to bed all day yesterday. I could not stop crying. It was like like the the veil had been lifted. Something had just gone. No, no more. This is real. This is how you feel. And you know, it is so unfair and unjust and chaotic out there. So we are in this space of love we are really pushing this one love one heart as one and when i say pushing i mean we're pushing through the fear we are, you know it really it really has been unbelievable you know how are our grandchildren going to to be able to explain this how are we going to explain it to their children? Because it is just incredible. You know, there are lots of blessings though. My gorgeous youngest grandson, Frank, he walked for the very first time today. I received the video um, just before I came on air here and it is a miracle. It's so beautiful. His birthday is on the 21st of June. He came in on that summer solstice and he is a absolute joy and that's the time the 21st of June when really this energy will will really lift because we're being we're being taken along on this wave and it really is a wave it's so so strong and if you are uh, feeling that it is too strong just stop stop give yourself a break give yourself some time hold on to your favorite crystals and just allow the angels to come through and they're going to do that right now they're coming in as we speak so <laughs> take a breath and just let's all really receive this light the message that we have today on the motivational messages of a little boy who's taking hugs and roses to uh, old people in their homes. This was, he'd been doing it for the last two years. He's unable to do it now, obviously, another sadness, but he, but seeing the joy is just fantastic. And we also have a message about uh, truth and lies, which uh, is a wonderful lesson for all of us. So in this moment then, let's really, really let these angels come through because that's what we're here for, to receive, to receive this love, 
to receive the light of the angels of awakening, the angels of Avalon. So take a breath. This column of light, this pillar of love, as you just surrender into the space of the heart. Through the flower, the flames of ascension, through the violet, indigo, purple colours of light, of love, through to the pearl of your heart, this white sphere of light. And as you just let go into this space, stepping into the one love of the one heart, of the one breath and breathe, receive, receive this love. the angels send out this love beaming this light I was watching the children at the school next door in St John's and they were playing with their ball and all I kept hearing was don't drop the ball <laughs> and that's the joy of it isn't it don't drop the ball and if you do drop the ball so what pick it up again today is another day Today is a day to choose happiness, to choose joy, to take care of yourself, to love yourself. I love you. I really, really had to find the love yesterday for myself. Oh, it was hidden under so much stuff and it's still being revealed. So enjoy the day enjoy every moment be in every moment as these beautiful angels just beam this light out to you whatever your crystal your favorite crystal is just pick it up and hold it hold it to your heart hold it to your gut allow the crystal allow the angels to really help you in every moment because they will you just have to invite them in you just have to recognise that they are really there. And if you're committed, carry on, have the courage. Keep going. That was my message yesterday to me. Just allow everything to unfold. The angels say, and they keep saying, it will be okay. It will take time. It will be a little rough waters for a while, especially up till the 21st of June. But we are in these, in these times of change and it's how we create these changes, how we create, how we deal with it. And the only way to deal with it is through love, through that silent place in the center of your heart, your knowing where you know that actually everything is going to be okay. Trust, feel and know that you, the universe is taking care of you because the universe will and does take care of you. Just look out for the signs. They are there, they really are there. This ball of calcite has so many rainbows in it, so much love, so much light. It's millions of years old millions and millions of years and what does it tell us it tells us that it will be okay and that one day we'll be polished <laughs> if we choose to be <laughs> 
I do hope you are receiving the love from Avalon. We're sending it out every day. We're sending it out to be this space, this 11 minutes for you to receive from the angels, the angels of awakening. These angels are of love. They are magnificent. They are so huge and they're here to help us. Receive the love, open your hands, just open your hands to receive. It's so hard to, to sometimes just let go and let Gaia, let Gaia, let Gaia into your heart. Go on, let her in. And so, as I bring this light to you, this wonderful big hug, oh goodness me, do we need hugs. This wonderful big hug from my heart to yours. And as you feel this hug, as you give yourself a hug, have a good shake. Really feel yourself, feel the liveness in yourself. And if the tears come, just allow them to come. And if the energy of your heart is of sadness, allow the sadness to be there until the joy can bubble through, because it will. With love from me to you. Thank you so much for watching every day. I never know who is watching and yesterday I found out. So bless you. Thank you. Thank you from my heart to yours. Big love, big blessings, big open heart. I love doing that, don't you? Big open heart. So have a wonderful day. Take care. Lots and lots of love. Brush off anything that is heavy on your shoulders. My grandson taught me how to do this. It was a dance, apparently. But I just love clearing the space. Namaste. Have a fabulous day.